This video shows how the high voltage version of the 9103 can float up to plus or minus 5,000 volts DC. Floating means that the signal reference is at some value other than ground potential. The standard 9103 is referenced to the outer cylinder of the BNC connector, which is typically at ground potential. This schematic shows the functionality of how, when floating, the BNC connector is connected to the high voltage source. Since BNC connectors are only rated for a maximum voltage of 600 volts DC, we use 5 kV SHV and MHV connectors for the 9103 HV version. The floating voltage is an MHV connector and the signal input is a SHV connector. We can also configure both connections as SHV. This schematic shows how the high voltage 9103 is typically used to measure electrons or ion current in a vacuum chamber. By biasing the 9103 higher or lower than the voltage potential of the incoming current, the collector plate can accelerate or retard those ions or electrons. Being able to float the collector plate up to plus or minus 5 kV DC opens up opportunities for lots of interesting experiments. For the purpose of this video, we made a test box that uses a 9 volt battery and a 10 mega ohm resistor to create a 9 microamp current source that can be floated up to 5 kV. We used a Hippotronics 20 kV supply to float this isolated current source up to 5,000 volts. Here the 9103 high voltage version is shown. Step one is we turn on the power switch on the front panel. The USB cable is connected to the PC. The HV connector connects to the voltage source, the high voltage source. And the input connects to the 9 volt current source inside of the test box that we made. That will be floated up to plus 5,000 volts DC. Again, this is a schematic of the test box, which shows how the current source is floated up to 5,000 volts DC. Next, we open the 9103 control software, Actuel, and then we open the data logging dialog box. Select Show Options, and then let's start measuring current. we get the expected 9 microamps or so of current. Now let's start increasing the high voltage and float the 9103 up while at the same time measuring current from the test box battery and resistor. With the graph set to zero baseline you can see that the current is very stable. As I increase the voltage more, the current is fluctuating a little bit, as you would expect since the reference voltage is changing. I will increase the voltage some more, and we see that things are pretty stable considering that the reference voltage is changing by hundreds of volts. Let's increase the voltage all the way up to 5 kV. If I turn the zero baseline off, we can zoom in on the current scale and better see the very small fluctuations from when the high voltage is being increased. Overall, the 9103 is very stable both when the high voltage is increased and also when the high voltage is up at the full 5,000 volts DC above ground. For more information, visit us at rbdinstruments.com.